Hey everyone, welcome to the Crypto ZX channel. If you're new, do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe. But now let's get right into today's analysis, which is regarding none other than Veracity. We're going to be doing our daily analysis on the price of Veracity, discussing what is happening with the price and where we could see the price going in the immediate short term. As always, just a quick disclaimer that anything on this channel is not financial advice. Always do your own due diligence and research when you are investing in cryptocurrency. So as of July 11th, if we're looking at the price, it's currently sitting at 0 0.0049 cents. We're up about 1.5% over the last 24 hours in USD comparative. We're also up about 1% in both Bitcoin and Ethereum comparative over the last 24 hours. Looking at its market cap, on the other hand, this is something I want you guys to pay very close attention to because you know the market cap is holding really strong around that 50 million dollar mark which is a huge level of you know support for the price of veracity in terms of its market cap the 24 hour trading volume is currently sitting at 5.1 million of course you know i've made it clear before that you know the buying pressure is just not there for itself um, but we need to remember not all of the big tier one exchanges have veracity listed on their platforms hence you know we are not seeing that crazy amount of volume coming in but i think that is organic we will see that uh, happen we will see more tier one exchanges come on board as we do go further into this bull cycle of course which is just starting but now what is some news revolving around here you know i wanted to really share this with you guys because you know it gives us like a better you know understanding as to what veracity is really doing it's more than just a coin that you guys are investing in um, it says digital ad fraud is imminent issue the damage caused by digital ad fraud is expected to reach over $100 billion. Veracity, um, you know, patent blockchain based module ensures bot prevention and detects invalid traffic with an accuracy of 97.5%. And, you know, in a time like we're in now, you know, when fraud is literally at its all time high, social media is, you know, part of our life, literally our day to day life, you know, companies that are paying billions of dollars to advertise you know their business guess what they would need this type of you know technology to really make sure that you know there's not fraud happening and that's the beauty of blockchain and this is very very uh, you know really really bullish and the use case when you kind of look at it from the use case point of view it's massive and that's why a lot of people are, you know, really, really bullish on Veracity's future. And speaking about bullish, look at its holder count. 77,800 holders were up over the past 24 hours. New holders coming in. And, you know, for a project with only $50 million market valuation, it has a holder count of almost 80,000. 80,000 holders and that shows that you know most of these holders that are holding veracity right now are holding it for the long term they're not here for the short term gains they see a massive bigger picture um, in the upcoming years to come and that's what we're seeing happening with all these holders that are holding you know massive massive amounts of veracity which could potentially if it were to be hitting those crazy predictions that a lot of people are making and even i've made a crazy crazy prediction that you know if bitcoin of course is able to reach those crazy heights that a lot of people are anticipating blackrock etf is um you know approved you know, we do see Veracity being listed on other massive exchanges. This could really make Veracity one of the most undervalued projects right now in terms of, you know, the future. And that's why I'm very excited on this. And so are so many other people. But now let's look at the price and see what really is happening with the price. So if we're looking at the price, you know, pretty much since we retested this level of resistance at that 0 0.0058 cents mark, we've been rejected, you know, been pretty much trading with this within this range. And obviously this range is a level of support. We have a lot of support built up around that level. And obviously the price is hanging around here. Now you may be saying, why is the price? of veracity not retesting its resistance because guys bitcoin is seeing a lot of volatility within its price look at it right now we're seeing a 
lot of sideways momentum happening for the price of Bitcoin, 31,000 uh, 31, to 30K, 31,000 to 30K. That shows manipulation is occurring and that is going to affect the price of Veracity and of course other cryptocurrency projects as well. And we're also seeing BTC dominance, you know, making its way back above yearly highs. And so, you know, these are some factors that you need to keep in mind when you're analyzing the charts. But nonetheless, you know, it's looking great in my opinion. As I've shared with you guys before, it's a matter of time, you know, when we break out of this level of resistance because let me tell you something from the june 10th lows you're still up about 27 percent and it's seeing a little bit of a retracement since this of course monthly high which we set for ourselves back in june about 16 percent and obviously this level of resistance shouldn't be taken with a grain of salt because we did have huge amounts of support built up pretty much throughout the entire year and obviously dates back to last year as well so you know in order for us to break out of here this would be a massive massive milestone because this could literally trigger you know a new rally for the price of Arasi which could potentially take the price to its new yearly high quite sooner than a lot of people really think in order for it to hit a new yearly high it needs a move of about 143 percent remember what I've told you guys from the beginning you know a project with a market cap of only 50 million dollars it's not hard to push these projects uh to those heights so you know things are looking great um in terms of you know the short-term time frame the long-term time frame of course you know if we're speculating and you know we see all these things come out for veracity you know the team is doing everything it can to really get things rolling for itself because remember you know team plays a huge role in terms of the price um, growth and we're seeing the team do its part i'm sure if you guys are part of the veracity community you're seeing that happening but you know if things really align for itself bitcoin etf gets approved you know Binance comes in list as coinbase comes in list as other tier one exchanges that have not listed veracity as of now come and list this this could be one of the biggest movers in my opinion um, and i think some people could uh you know really make some massive gains off of this but this does not mean you know you only want to be holding veracity if you've done your due diligence and research um you know and you do want to invest what you can afford to lose in veracity of course keep some in your portfolio but don't just um have you know just veracity in your portfolio because you will miss out on a lot of gains on other projects so this is where you want to diversify you know your portfolio and when you have done that have an exit strategy in place you know you need to be making an exit strategy for yourself where you know when to lock in profits where you will be comfortable locking in profits because if you're not able to do that you will be left behind and i'm going to be making a very very important update and it's not only going to be about veracity it's going to be for every cryptocurrency holder it's going to show why it's so important how you can succeed more than 99 percent of the people i'm going to make a video on that so stay tuned you know hit your bell icon if you have not already turn your notifications on because that video is going to be very very informative but that is it for today's update i'm really liking what veracity is doing long-term perspective still quite high um you know mega bullish in my opinion you know especially if everything were to come true as what we have discussed but we're going to take it one step at a time let me know in the comment section what you guys think is happening love you all see you tomorrow in crypto zx and peace out